Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. How are you doing today, my friend? Um, in today's video, I'll be talking about, I'll be sharing with you this new Facebook tool that allows you to remove inactive friends off your friends list. You know, it's very powerful. You know, there's a few tools out there that I used to have, you know, I shared it with you guys, but unfortunately, they just stopped working. As you see here in this post, they posted that um, I just received over a thousand inactive people on my Facebook friends list. You know, um, this software does a lot of stuff. Not only remove um, active friends, but it scans. What it does is scans your your entire friends list for inactive friends, right? And you can remove mass amount of friends at the same time. Um, it allows you, which allows you to connect with the most engaged friends, it leave you the most engaged people. On your friends list because we all want to connect with people who engage with us or the people who are not engaging with us is holding back our reach on Facebook all right you could also add tag targeted friends to uh, by countries by location and you could mass message friends on your prospect and a lot of other stuff you could do with the tool so I'm gonna give you a quick demo a live demo of this tool okay so basically I'm gonna load the tool right now once you get into once you get access to this tool on the home page, they allow you to scan your friends list for the last 12 months. Okay. So what you're going to do, click on post for the last 12 months and you're going to scan through to see who's actually been actively engaged with your post. Okay. Now, like I said, I've been running this software for a while now. And right now I have three to five more friends left to, um, left to remove. That's people who are not interacting with my post. Okay. So I want to get rid of them because like I said, it holds your reach back. It holds you back from Facebook showing your stuff to other people, to the, to the right people on your, on the newsfeed. Okay. So you want to get rid of this dead weight so you can expand your reach. So basically all you got to do is just, um, you could select all, remove all, or you could do it individually. If you want to go through and do it in individually, you can, you know, you could scroll through the list to see if anybody you want to keep, but my advice to you, if the software finds these individuals as not engaging with your post, my would you just go ahead and remove all. All I have to do, hit remove. The software going to do its thing. See, it's from 55 friends to remove. If I already remove one, it's going to go through the process and remove those 55 individuals. So if I just go to my time right now I have 2,872. So let me just refresh that page. And as you see now, 2,869. So it's actually going there and remove, remove these folks. Okay. So, oops. Can I find this real quick? Can I find this tool where it's running? So it's going to go through this thing and remove those friends. Refresh. 2866 they're going to remove all 55 inactive friends so let me just give it a little while let it run you have to get your hand on these tools if you've been looking for a tool to clear up your facebook inactive friends this is the tool that you need okay the link going to be right below in the description go ahead and click that link check it out purchase the tool and put it to work for you you're going to have great results by using these tools and i'm going to show you what else the tools could do um as well so right now 45 but if it's actually clean it's this working still so let me pull this tie back up where is it at uh -huh. so 12 frames removed so it's still working still working still working close this down Still running in the background. So he's going and he's doing his things, working his magic. Let me finish my page again. 2,855 friends. So he's going to go through and remove all 55 of my friends list. So let me. And you could also go in here and message people. Um, recently, you could message all the recently added friends in the last seven days, two weeks, one month, three months. You can set how many messages you want you to send and the delay time 
in between his message so you don't get blocked on Facebook. You could add friends, right? Um, so I'm gonna show you here real quick. Let me just go to, I'm going to show you guys how do you add friends by location targeting. So you know, most times when you go in here in Facebook, when you add people, um, like let me find a post, you have people from different countries that's actually gonna be liking and commenting and interacting with other network marketers. So if you wanna add targeted friends to your list, what you're gonna to have to do, and you wanna add them by country, what I normally do, what the software allows you to do is go to like, I go to Network Marketing Pro. We all know Eric Worry. Uh, people connect with him from around the world. So I'm gonna find a post with a lot of likes, you know, uh, let's, let's, let's do this for like 160, 160 likes, okay? And we have 160 likes, 123 likes, 135 um, love to wow. But I'm gonna just go to likes, okay? And then I'm gonna open the tool up and say add friends. You see right now you selected 160 friends. So now the number of people I wanna add as friend, I could change the amount how much I wanna add. If you wanna add the 160, you put it in there. And targeted country. Our country, that means you're going to go to every single person here on that likes this post and add them. But if you go in and put UK, US, um, Canada, Australia, New Zealand, or you could select individually. Say I want to add people just from the UK. I'm going to click US. The time delay in between. I'm going to put um, 22 seconds. And I want to add people with mutual friends. Okay. Only mutual friends. That means I see here people say like this person have 18 mutual friends with me. And that's what I want to add. Now, if you didn't select this, what happens when you're trying to add someone that don't have mutual friends with you? Facebook normally gives you a pop-up saying, do not add people that you don't know. Okay, so when, when you select the ones that we only with mutual friends, you know, most likely the friend request is going to go through. And now all you have to do is click add friends. I don't want to run this part because I'm actually running this section of the tool. You can't mul you cannot multitask on Facebook. You don't want to multitask on Facebook because, you know, you don't want them to know that you're running a software because Facebook wants you to interact with people as a human being, not softwares. Okay. So while this is actually running to remove friends, I'm going to just wait until it's finished before I actually go in here and try and add people to show you guys that the software run. Okay. And also, you could also cancel those friend requests. If you send those friend requests, you could actually cancel them, you know, by with this tab. But guys, what you want to do, you actually want to connect with targeted people so you want to go down and find your targeted audience and add them to your friends list. so now if you like i said this tool i've been using it i've been running it guys you know and by me removing those inactive people off my friends list is actually you know i'm actually seeing new people that i, I haven't connected with before i've seen them in my, my, in my news feed and now more people i'm going to have to be able to expand my reach so we have 2825 let me refresh this 2,824, and just a few more to go. See, remove 49 friends, six more to go. I'll let it run. This tool is great. This tool is amazing, right? Four more to go, let it run. I'm just let it run it out and finish up, man. Then you'll see, I'll open it back again so you'll see that the tools actually work. So only three more inactive friends. So he's wiping this stuff out, getting rid of the dead weight. One more to go. And once it's complete, you're going to hear that, that sound. So let's so see if I go back in here, open it back up. And I could run it again, say so in the last 12 months to see if anyone is inactive. Now you don't want to, I would probably run this off again um, to scan my friend. It's probably in about a month time. You know, and see who's not interacting with my post. So there you got it. Um, go ahead. The link is under the video. Go ahead and click on that link and pick up your software. And I'll talk to you soon.